okay what is objects and properties let's uh, remove these codes and just clear it see uh, type const user equal to here username tick Zain comma password one one two three four so console dot log off sorry dot log off user now I'm going to run the code node type dot js so you see here username take cousin and the password one two three four so this is the uh, this is the object here in the javascript now i'm going to define the function inside the uh, object i'm going to give the comma here and the, i'm going to use the function name found found the function arrow okay here console dot log off Mm, I'm going to give hi this is username now I'm going to run the code here before that I, uh, I'm using the I'm use the function here so I'm going to change it here to user dot found off now I'm going to run the code here hmm, I'm getting the error okay why means this one it's it's inside the object so I have to define the keyword this dot so now I'm going to run the code again so hi this is undefined why I'm getting this undefined is because this is defined as the global runtime so I have to define it inside the object so what I'm going to do is uh, uh, we can do it in the uh, old ways like a function here but function of uh, we can define like this hi this is tecuzin or in the newer versions it can be more simplified by removing the function here and I'm going to remove the colon so now it is found off uh, uh, with the open and close bracket uh, we have the console.log of the other uh, the data now I'm going to run the node type.js you can see the output hi this is tecosine now we are going to see about the array methods in javascript we can uh, define the array like that const subjects equal to it should be defined in a square bracket so array is nothing but of series of uh, types like a string or numbers for example here I'm going to use the string max science okay to output the out uh, to output it for lit subject subject of uh, subjects console dot uh, dot log of subject now node type dot js okay see you can see the output max and size if we remove this one I'm just going to command this one and I'm going to see the output here I can see the max and size so it means arrays it will display the output as a series now we are going to see about the methods what are the methods available for the arrays for example in the javascript if you can see subjects dot you can see many methods here so here you can see concat every entries or fill or there are many now we are going to see about a map so subjects dot map of map is nothing but of adding the new arrays uh, but not changing the older one for example if you see the output here if I use the map here console dot log off see uh, I'm going to add the new array 
so to do that i have to define the new uh, string for example map of uh, subject subject to subject is plus subject so i'm going to output this one and just to command this one subject is max and the subject is science you can see the output that it is not uh, changing anything gold for example if you see the output of a console dot log of subjects here i am going to run the output see here the new one is subject is max and the subject is science but we have the older one also so it means when you are using the map it transform the new values okay it it's it just uh, transform the older values into new values but it will not change anything any any older values now i'm going to show you how to add any uh, new values in the in the arrays for example if you can use subjects dot push off like uh, uh, we can use computer so now i'm going to output this one please command this one and if you see the output here you can see uh, it's added new thing but if you notice one thing i'm using here constant so as i told previously when using the constant the value cannot be changed but you have to understand one thing this is a, this is an array function this we are not using we are not changing anything we are just uh, adding some uh, new strings okay so we are not changing anything it's already addressed here so we are not uh, removing anything and we are adding we are pushing a new items here this is the end of the course here so if you like the course please like share and subscribe and we will see in the next course thank you